Okay, down here. Okay, here is my second Alcatel uh, A845L phone. Uh, let's cover off. Here's the battery. Trying to get the see if I can make the words focus. I don't know if they will. I've tried. Uh, there's a 64 gigabyte SD card. I put in there the yellow and white, and then there's the uh, um, uh, the uh, card. You know. You know, the one that makes it call and stuff. Okay, so, uh, it doesn't recognize the, uh, on the, uh, SD card. It doesn't, just like they said, it, it says, they say it only supports up to, uh, 32 gigabyte. And that's what I have with this phone I'm recording on. And they're identical phones. Um, but I already read before I bought the bigger card that, uh, if you format them to fat, People were formatting them to FAT32, and then they'd read the, read it just fine. And I also thought, well, I could always divide it up in two partitions, you know. But uh, anyway, <coughs> the EX FAT is what comes on there, and I actually hadn't really come across it. Uh, I use Linux pretty much exclusively. I only use Windows. I found out that it is a Windows, Microsoft-owned partitioning uh, file system partitioning it's a microsoft home file system and but it does uh, you can make bigger files uh, on it bigger than four gigabyte which is uh, said said to be the limit on the fat 32 so um and i fooled around with it and i uh, there's a little 16 megabytes at the beginning that wasn't formatted so i formatted it i didn't want to lose that x fat until i was sure you know anyway i fooled around with it <clears throat> and I, uh, I don't know if I can really show anything here, but we'll try. Um, just for the heck of it. Let's get in my pictures. If I can uh, hold still on my screen while I do this. Oh, that's why I'm, nothing's coming up. I usually always keep everything as uh, sorted by mod last modified first. So, um, my screenshots is what I'm going to show. I guess, I guess I should make a real desktop video, but, uh, what I did was, uh, let's see which way to go. I tried several different, uh, tried FAT16, which worked, but, and it did show up in my phone, but of course it, I was, it wasn't enough space to use, and I don't want, definitely don't want FAT16. I tried, uh, um, ext3. I tried F XFS because I thought I wasn't doing any research. I was just guessing, and I said, "Oh, maybe that's the same as uh, just the way they're shortening down XFAT." But it wasn't. I went and looked it up, and it's uh, another kind of uh, journaling file system that I hadn't come across. And it went on there, just you know, it did it just fine. You can't do. Uh, let's see. Did I find a way to do XFAT? I tried to do one. There it is. Uh, which one was that? I was trying to do one that uh, when it failed, it kept going back and reformatting it as FAT16 for some reason, even though I had it empty when I started. I tried to do one that uh, I'd pay attention here to what on my screen says I'd know. Oh, it didn't work. XFS didn't work because it has to be a minimum file size of 32 megabytes. I didn't notice that at first. And, of course, I've only got 16 megabytes total there on there. Actually, well, 15, really. Well, it's 16 megabytes, and you can make 15 on it. So it'll let you do. And I made XT3 uh, at the one of the first things I did. And uh, before I did FAT16, and the uh, phone couldn't read that. Couldn't see that either, so... Uh, I think what I'm going to do, uh, I like using, you know, Gparted or this uh, pro this program that I ended up, I actually got FAT32 to work at one point, I 
believe. Let's see where where did I do that? I took so many screenshots. Yeah, there's X Fat. Well, I think I got it. I think I finally found a way to do it. I tried the KDE when it didn't have I don't really use the KDE that one app very much, so it didn't have anything uh it was missing some dependencies basically. But the native uh disk app comes with Fedora so it, it I use it mostly to look at stuff because it usually gets errors when I try to do things. Uh except for it's good at backing up and restoring disk images. Uh, but uh Yeah, there's where I was looking. It'll do, uh, it, it's kind of hit and miss. And uh, G parted or parted, I like to use the graphic one G parted. It'll do, uh, as long as you've got a new opera, I got a Fedora 23, as long as you, your operating system's new enough, <coughs> it'll do most anything. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> it's common. But, um, I wasn't planning on making a long video, and now I'm kind of going off doing it. Let's see. Um, well, anyway, <coughs> all I was trying to get, make a point of is that uh, I did make, I did for, I did, did format it as. Uh, I ended up doing it once with departed and once with this application. I, I did. Uh, I remember which one I did now. I did one of them with this application here and in, the, in this screenshot. Um, we're actually looking at it in Gwen View Image Viewing Editing App. But uh, yeah, I didn't go with HP. I never did do it at NTFS. I was just showing what was there. Strontium is the brand of the uh, SD card. It's a good card. I've been using it. I, it has a adapter. It comes with it. Whoops. Let's put it up here. There's two adapters. I know I'm throwing this phone around like crazy. I kind of forgot what I was doing, didn't I? Anyway, it comes with two adapters. Uh, one to, uh, where it'll go into an SD card slot and one where it'll go uh, into a USB. So that makes it really easy to work with. I like that a lot. <coughs> so um, that's what made it easy for you to sort of play around with it like that. So I, um, yeah, there's the note where it was missing uh, the KDE ver uh, disk, disk editing app was missing some stuff. So I, um, did new yeah I did that's where I did or tried to do XFS and of course it told me the first time I tried it 32 megabyte mount on the size and I got, it didn't work of course anyway I did do XT3 I don't I, I'm sitting here look I'm sitting here looking at my computer and didn't really see the screenshots that I was looking for but um, uh, the, the phone again the phone couldn't recognize it so uh, I'm going to put the card in the phone and format it that way. And that, and it'll pro I don't know what it'll do. Probably FAT32. Uh, I'm thinking that's my best uh, best way to get. Probably won't even tell me what it formats it. I'm figuring, but I'll let it do it. And if I don't like it, I can always fix it in my Linux box. But uh, yeah, that's why I was doing FAT16. EX FAT. Yeah. Oh, that's it. That's the one that's already on there. I never did see any way that I could format ex exfat exfat. Um, that and I was, you know, kind of hesitant to uh, erase it and reformat it if I couldn't get it back to that in case I didn't like what I ended up with. But I'm going to do it because I uh, I want to be able to put this in the phone and use it and. Uh, <coughs> If I had to go with FAT32, then, you know, I don't think, the only thing that would be as big as 4 gigabyte would be a video. And uh, what I read about these phones here, the the biggest, uh, it doesn't say for sure, but it, it, actually I was looking in the open camera app, the app that I'm using right now, and it just generally says, well, most phones, 
will do uh, either three or four gigabyte file size maximum. So that's the only big files I would ever think of having on here. So and it can, and and uh, then you can set uh, Open Camera to automatically restart if it gets too big of a file or while you're working. So and usually they end up around. Uh, I don't. I've only seen some of my videos. On, you know, if I just go ten minutes or something. I've got it set as high as I can get it, high quality, um, on this phone. It's a five meg, five. Well, it's only five megapixel camera, but the video is only like two point seven or something. So, but I've got it set at uh, twenty megabits per second and uh, thirty frames per second. Bit rate twenty megabits per second. And uh, anyway, it be up to one gigabyte fairly quick. You know, about ten, five, ten minutes. You bet. Did a couple about 18, 20 minute videos, and well, that was probably before I set it that high. But anyway, if I keep on jabbering that long, then um, I, as long as I can keep it set to restart, it keeps taking itself out of that mode every time. You, if you touch anything else on that screen, but anyway, I'm going in circles. Uh, I want to be able to go as long, as long, as uh, long as I have space to store because. I'd like to use these two phones as, as like two cameras shoot, you know, one is a wide angle and one's as, as the one I'm holding or mounted them somewhere uh, on my helmet head or so, head or hat or something to do if sometimes I might want to do, uh, you know, project videos while I'm making, building something, so anyway, that's why I want big, big, uh, big a memory card as I can in, in these things. The first other phone I just went ahead, the one I'm using right now, I have a 32 gig card in it. And uh, I've already got it half filled. I'm going to have to delete all these videos that are in it. I've been backing them up on a on a desktop. So um, that's why I'll have to go with it, so, uh, so that it'll have enough space for me to actually use it. You know. So anyway, let's uh, let's put that SD card back in the other phone. Well, it's already in there, <coughs> and uh, I will. Uh, I think I'll put the cover back on it and uh, for, let the phone format it and see what happens there, and then we'll go from there. All right, on, signing out.